with storm season upon us, we want to protect our homes and make sure it is as strong as it can be in case the rain and the wind comes. So, John went out to Hardware Hawaii to go see what Simpson Strong is all about. All right, we're out here at Kailua's Hardware Hawaii and we're hanging out uh, with Tim and Joel. And I just wanna let everybody know that there's a whole aisle for Simpson uh, products, and we're talking today about the Strong Ties. What's up, guys? Thanks for having us out. Appreciate Thanks it. Uh, tell me about the Simpson Strong Ties. What are those exactly? Well, Simpson Strong Ties, a manufacturer of structural hardware and epoxies and stuff like that. We help people design and build better structures. Okay. Um, you guys are known for a lot of stuff, but tell me what you guys uh, are known for exactly manufacturing. Sure. We manufacture connectors among other things, but connectors that hold buildings together. Um, that can be hurricane ties, that can be column caps, that can be hold downs, basically connecting the roof of the structure all the way through the continuous load path down to the foundation. Okay, I love that we're talking about this because this is perfect timing given the fact that we just had two storms pass us. Um, older homes, is there anything folks with older homes that they can do? I mean, I know you have some examples here, but can you maybe explain what they can do with older homes? Yeah, absolutely. This is a mock-up of single wall construction, which is really unique to Hawaii. And they don't have clips in them. Most of them, have, unless they've been retrofitted, they just don't have. So we went back to the drawing board and did testing and came up with this clip. It's called the HPT clip. Okay. And this was made just for Hawaii. We just developed this for the single wall homes and the geometry of these. Wow, so, okay, so tell me exactly what that does. So this mock-up of single wall construction, which thousands of people live in in Hawaii, this clip was made to grab onto the top plate and, go, and hold onto the rafter, increasing the likelihood that the roof won't blow off during a windstorm. It's good for about 400 pounds tested, and it took us a long time to come up with the geometry of this to get the 400 pounds. Okay, how hard is it? to install that? It's yeah, just very simple. It takes eight screws, four and four, and then one reinforcing screw through the trim board. And then one goes on every rafter. Okay. Now we also have something here that uh, that you guys have done a very good job of constructing with all the pieces. Tell me about what we have here. Sure, this is uh, part of our outdoor accents line. Okay. Um, they, you can build pergolas, mm -hmm. you can build Oh, quite a few things actually. You can see them on this counter over here. Um, but what we've done is we've taken steel, okay, bent it, and we've put decorative cuts in it. This happens to be our mission collection. We also make an Avant collection, okay, which is more square looking. Uh, that steel is coated with uh, zinc. It's it's what we call our proprietary Z Max coating, so it has a higher protection uh, against corrosion. And then we powder coat it. Okay. And the finish comes out very smooth. We yeah. make it for, if you're doing six by construction, there's a T for six by, there's a four by L. You can see what some of them look like on this mock up mm -hmm. over here. Very nice. I'm assuming this is not that difficult to do. It looks, it looks pretty simple. Actually, we've simplified this as well. If you look at this, it looks, it has the nice architectural look of bolted construction. Yep. Uh, but we don't do it that way, actually. What we did was, we came up with this washer, all right? And this, this is a structural screw, tested, okay. all right? Goes in there, and you end up with a nice structural connection, but it looks like it's bolted. Rather than having yeah. to drill through a four by and line it all up with the holes, all right? So it's quite I, unique. I noticed that you guys have thought of everything, including adding the bit into the, into the little packaging here for the screws that go with it. Correct, because we don't want you to forget it and have to come back to the hardware store, right? There you so. go. So the bits in the packaging, I think this is fantastic. Uh, easy to do? Can yeah, you want to try can, one? Yeah, let's try it. All right. This would be for a four by four. Okay. Now this would typically be anchored down to, to some type of footing or foundation. Right. Um, there's an anchor bolt that would come up. And then you, it's got a standoff plate. Okay. You just put that in. And I don't want to go this way so they can see it. You okay. want to drive it? Screwdriver sure, right down do there. It. So for demonstration purposes, we're just going to lay this down. Okay. Usually it would be anchored into the concrete. Okay. So there's, there you go. So you take your so nut. You a nice little thing here. Yep. Drop it in. Okay. 
Make sure this is uh, going the right way. Smart. A lot of people still think of one. Nope. Hello, hello. It'll go. There you go. These holes on this side and on this side are offset. So you can go in from both sides and your screws won't hit. Okay. And that's how you end up with this. The, the double. This is this is a great design. Now I understand. Speaking of design, I understand that you guys have uh, some designs and some um, templates that you can design uh, or at least download off your website. Tell me about that real quick. We have a lot of DIY projects that you can do with your family. You can get your kids involved. They can make tool tool benches, uh, shelving for to organize the garage. You can make uh, chicken coops, planter boxes, all oh, that. That's awesome. The drawings are all on our website. Doghouse. Download is on there. Yeah. Oh, that's great. So uh, download the templates, make it yourself. Right. It'll even give you a cut list of what you need to buy. You know, give you a material list so you can come in the hardware store and pick everything up all at once. Well, I'd say go ahead and uh, download whatever you need off the website because this was really easy, and I'm sure everything else that you guys have there is easy. In fact, why don't we go ahead and tell our viewers uh, the website? Sure, it's strongtie.com, just www.strongtie.com. Thanks for uh, letting me play around a little bit and learning a little something as well. You guys are great. Thank you so much. You're hired. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Thank you. You're hired. I, I got to say, I'm not real good with that kind of stuff, but they make it real easy. I mean, the bit is included in Thank the packaging. You. Yeah, if they, the, you know, the the examples, the instructions for all the things that you want to build are right there on the website. Yeah, super easy. I love that. It's the step by step process. Yeah. Um, and we'll have more information on cagement2.com as yes, always. Yes, we will.